Hey everybody, I, I know I'm not my normal happy self right now, but uh, l let me go through my intro and I'll explain. Uh, welcome to My Name Isn't Patrick, My Name Is Patrick. This is a beer in a bag. I, I open it up, I review it, I react to it. I've never seen it before. It's, it's a surprise to me. And I, I check it out, I drink it, I give it a score from one to 10. Uh, in the last episode, uh, I had a talk with the producer at the end and he wasn't very keen on my ideas and said I needed to work harder. So I'm now locked in this room until I finish reviewing the rest of my season three beers. That's probably going to take a couple weeks, honestly. So I, there's not a lot of amenities here. Next week is my birthday. I was kind of hoping to like see my family and I, I guess I'm just going to be here. You know, like it's kind of sad, but I got, I mean, I got this sausage. I guess it's supposed to last me. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty good. Gotta last me like four weeks, maybe three weeks, but I think I'll be okay. You know, you gotta be optimistic. You gotta think. You gotta be stuck in a room, drinking beers, editing videos for three weeks. You know, I got a bucket. So things not so bad. Dream? I can't tell. You tell me what this says. Dream or cream? I think it, look, you help me out. What is this letter? Dream with a J? You know, I gotta I gotta spell dream with a J. Dream, I gotta look like an idiot. You're gonna see this in the title. I put the drink name in the title and you're gonna read Dream, like what? A strawberry banana marshmallow white chocolate. Strawberry banana marshmallow white chocolate. Uh, Burley Oak Brewing Company in Maryland. A sour ale with a only 4.8 alcohol by volume. So I have done a tripping animals drink before. A tripping animals drink that it tasted like a, a uh, banana split and it was really good and it had a lot of the same flavors that are being put forward here. Strawberry banana marshmallow white chocolate. I love that one. So this is going to be, ooh, oh, a color, kind of a murky, muddy color. Yeah, kind of a muddy color coming out. Yeah, look at that murkiness. <laughs> Not the best color, I'll be honest. I, I was hoping maybe something kind of pink, something kind of fruity. This kind of looks like dirty rear, like a bad crayon. Oof. Well, I'll tell you this, I wouldn't chase this with the cheese sausage. Um, <laughs> oh man. So the, the flavors are changing, like from the beginning to end. Hold on. Oh, strawberry up front. Strawberry and banana, right up front. Then it goes into like sweet and sour. I'm not getting anything that I would call marshmallow. I'm not getting anything I would call white chocolate. I, I I taste sweetness, I taste the sour. It's like that that strawberry banana like hits you like a flavor gum and you chew it and it's really good and it goes right away and then you're just kind of stuck with gum. It's a sour, I'm trying to get to see if there's any, there's no pulp. I'm not getting like a bunch of pulp, and a bunch of fruitiness at the end. So, ooh. Let me double check that sausage theory. Hold on. Yeah, no. Not good with the sausage either. Knowing that there is a, a tripping, another sour that I had only a few weeks ago that pulled off a similar flavor combination, but better, makes me way more sad. I feel like this is not living up to like the, the pile of flavors that it's trying to pitch me. Strawberry, banana, sweetness, sour. It's okay. If you find this, if you're here in Maryland and you find it and you think it's kind of cool, I think it would be a neat flavor. I think they should have just stuck to the strawberry banana sour because those flavors hit. Five out of 10, five out of 10. It's really not bad. I just feel like it it, it fails in expectations. So yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm gonna sit here, I'm gonna eat the rest of my sausage and I'm gonna just um, stare at this wall. So uh, have a nice night.